Here we am, looking dead again. <laughs> so hello everybody, today is the 12th of February. It is currently 25 past eight. Just finished getting myself ready. I'm not at work today because I've worked longer hours this week, so I do have a day off. I have just got myself ready. I'm gonna go into town because I've got a Specsavers appointment at 25 past nine in the morning. So I'm gonna get some new glasses hopefully today because I don't have my big glasses. I don't feel like they suit me, they don't look right, and I need an eye check. I'm probably going to go into Poundland as well while I wait. Hopefully I can get my glasses the same day. If not, I'm going to get them posted to me because otherwise I can't I can't go and get them. <laughs> probably go to Superdrug as well because I've got a £10 gift card and I need to get some more conditional and things anyway. So yeah, I'll catch you up hopefully when I'm in town or after my Specsavers appointment. So sad to see that. Look, it's literally dead. I think I've just come out of Specsavers. So now I'm walking to Superdrug, but it's literally dead. <laughs> Yeah, anyway, let's go to Superdrug now. It, honestly, it looks like I've just been through a load of rain and I've... My fringe is just fucked. <laughs> I've literally just got in the car because I've just been to Specsavers and Superdrug. But I'll show you that when I get back. And I went into Best Buys because I thought, oh, I won't go into Pie Shop because I had a, a drink of Coke on me. I don't want to think that the ro I've robbed it. I wish I did now because in Best Buys I was trying to find the ISO. £2.50! I thought, no chance, mate, no chance. So I went into Superdrug, intended to spend my gift card, and I forgot the bastard, didn't I? So, I'm absolutely boiling. So I've just got my glasses, my new ones. Well, these aren't my new ones, these are my old ones, but... Yeah, £19 they cost me, £19! They're not coming till next Thursday, and obviously I can't go and pick them up. So I asked for them to, to be delivered. So, yeah, and now I've got to go and pay, because the floor that I'm on, the flipping pay machine don't work, so I've got to go all the way up to come all the way down <sighs> I'm just oh so anyway I'm gonna go and find another parking space so then I can go and pay and then come back down right so anyway I will catch up when I get home after I've sweated my ass off so I'll see you in a bit right I just thought I'd come back oh my god I look like a fucking tramp my mirror my mirror needs washing and I'm gonna get it dyed tonight so ignore it but honestly just tell me why I thought I'd come back on before I go <laughs> Because why is it always me that does stupid stuff? Like why? The pay point that's on this level isn't available, so it's all covered over. You can't fucking pay. So I thought, oh, I'll go up to the other levels and maybe they've got one. So I went all the way fucking up, driving all the way up, trying to find a fucking a pay point thing. Tell me why there is no other pay points apart from the one that's on this floor and all the way at the ground floor. So I drove all the way up, right, empty as empty as out, come all the way down. I've come all the way down and I thought what what's the point why why are they not got another pay point up there unless I've missed it but I swear to god there's no other ones it's always me because the original one I wanted to go parking was Vic Centre I didn't realise it was closed so I had to go all the way back round I thought I'm going to be late for this appointment so I ended up parking in Talbot Street instead if you don't know Nottingham then they, these are the car parks in Nottingham in town um, so I'm in Talbot Street <laughs> so I've come all the way up and I thought when I left my car Earlier on, I thought I'll leave my ticket inside so I don't forget it. Should have took it with me because I've had to pay when I got to the bottom floor. So I've just come back up, drove all the way around, try and find another pay point. I had to drive all the way back down, parked in the same space that I was in, <laughs> but all the way downstairs to pay to come all the way back up again. Honestly, why is it me that does the stupidest things? I just don't get it. <laughs> and then this morning when I left my car, I thought. I ain't locked it, I ain't locked it, I do it every time, I thought, I ain't locked it, I ain't locked it, I ain't locked it. I got halfway down to where Vic Centre is, thought I'm going to have to go and check. So I had to walk all the way back up, walk all the way back up the stairs, but I fucked myself up, <laughs> trying to walk up the stairs, even though I should have took the lift, but anyway, and I'd locked it. Does anybody else do this? Does anybody else lock the car and then forget that they've locked the car, so they have to go back and check the car to make sure it is locked? I swear to God, it's always me that does stupid stuff like this. Please comment down below if you're exactly the same because I can't get over it. I, I literally can't get over it. <laughs> oh, Jesus. I am going to drive home now because I've paid. <laughs> so, hello everybody. I'm now back. Well, I've been for a few hours. Don't mind the fringe. I re-straightened it before I went out to go and get food shopping. Honestly, it's because it's greasy and I've had a mask on and it just goes everywhere. But anyway... I'm going to show you what I got from Superdrug while I'm at it. I bought the conditioners that I needed. So this is the, I'd say this all the time, I love Tresme. Tresme restructuring treatment mask. And this was on buy one get one, buy one get one free. So instead of it costing me £10 something, it only cost me £5 for two. So there's that. So I got two of them because every time I'm running out of them, I always get them when they're on offer. Like, 
Um, and I thought while I was in there, I'd pick up the new Maybelline Superstay. Now, I've got it before, but this is the active wear, and this is supposed to last up to 30 hours. So I thought I'd pick it up, but I might do it on a TikTok. So if you don't follow me on TikTok, it's it's funny. <laughs> um, so I thought I'd try that. Then I also managed to pick up my concealer, which I haven't been able to pick up. But this is the infin Infinite one. Uh, exactly the same but this is in 2.5 which is the shade I need in the normal one in this concealer here where is it yeah in the regular one conceal and define I can't find 2.5 inches drop anywhere um so I had to pick up the in infinite one I also picked up this is hyped all over TikTok and I thought I'd try it now I'm very very funny with my mascaras so this is like my baby this is my favorite one ever i always 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 use this one and i've tried so many other ones and i always seem to go back to this one but this one is so hard to find anywhere and it's never in at all anywhere um and i eventually found it like last last summertime on ebay that somebody was selling so i had to buy four of them but now that person that sold them doesn't sell them now and i can't find it again <laughs> So, yeah, this is the L'Oreal Mega Volume Miss Baby Roll one, but it's a waterproof version. Now, they do do the non-waterproof version, but I don't feel like it holds my lashes enough. Where is this one? The waterproof one does, and obviously it's waterproof, so if you sweat or if you cry or if you are in the bath, it doesn't, even though, why would you wear it in the bath, but you know, it doesn't come off as easily. But I'm so sad because I'm like, this is running out and I've got one left, and once I've used that, I don't know where I'm going to find it. So I thought I'd try this one. This is the Maybelline Sky High Lash Sensational. Now, everybody's raving about this. Everybody's saying it leaves your lashes so long and luscious and curled. And I swear to God, if this don't work, I'm going to cry. And if this works, I'm going to buy loads because I've been trying to find a different mascara for ages and I just haven't found it. And I know this is hyped over TikTok. So please be as good as it says because I'm desperate to find a new mascara that actually does what I like to do. And that's it. That's all I basically picked up from Superdrug. Oh no, one more thing. My powder, which I love, the Rimmel Match Perfection Powder. I had to pick another one in these up because um, I'm on my last one and I've not long opened Well, I've opened it for quite a while and it's about half gone. So I thought I'd pick another one while, while I'm in there. And then I had to pick myself up a cream eggs. Well, well two, because cream eggs are my favourite. Anyway, I've come upstairs because I'm going to get changed, so I've got my normal clothes on. Because me and my mum have, well, mum bought some resin things off ebay and we wanted to try it and just have a test and see how it works she made some mickey mouse ones and they look really good like really good so we just wanted to try it out and see how it works and you know whether we can make loads of different designs because they look really nice so we thought we'd have a go so that's what we're gonna do but obviously i'm not gonna wear my good clothes because if it gets stuff all over it i'm not gonna be able to get it out so yeah that's what i'm gonna do yeah that is it i think that's all we're gonna do i'm gonna dye me here later like i said because my hair is in desperate need of dyeing because it's grey, it's greasy, it's, it's disgusting. And then tomorrow, my mum is going to get her COVID jab, which she was a bit, she's a bit nervous about because not of the fact that nervous about getting the jab or having a need or anything like that, she's not worried about that. She's just worried about what's going to happen after, like the after effects. But I said to her, it'll be fine, we'll be all right. <laughs> and if, you know, something was to happen, then I'm suing, okay, <laughs> literally. So. Anyway, but I think it'll be fine. I think she's just a bit worried about what's going to happen, but I said it'll be alright. We'll be alright. We'll be fine. So we're downstairs doing the resin thing. So these are the silicone cups that my mum ordered. Well, actually I ordered the other day on Amazon. Then these are the moulds that my mum ordered, um, just to try out. So these are all like different shapes and stuff. I don't think you can even see it properly. And then the other ones. And then we've got even smaller ones, which I think is for like earrings and stuff. So they're them ones. I also picked these up from Own Bargains the other day. Thought that'd be nice to go in in them, but we ain't got big enough ones. So <laughs> might have to have <laughs> might have to buy a bigger one because that's gonna take up the whole thing. Yeah, so there's them. You didn't think of that. Um, Mum also bought these ones as well, which are really nice. So they're like dog paw prints or cat paw. No, they'll be dog paw prints, won't they? Does it matter? Dog all paw print, yeah. Ball cat prints, prints. Ball prints, aren't they? Um, and then some cat shapes as well, which my mum did actually the other day. I'll have to show you in a bit. And they're amazing. Oh, they're, they're amazing. Um, and then there's some small ones. And then we've just received these ones. This one's a dog paw print and it says love inside of it. I don't know why it's not focusing. And there's another one there with angel wings and dog print as well. Show you paw that. print in oh, this. Which 
I think mom was expecting these to be a bit bigger than that, but they're tiny. Um, and then these are the ones that mom did the other day. As a practice, that one don't look so bad. I feel, and it literally, it looks like under the sea. Like if you look at it, don't mind my nail. My nail's disgusting, but it looks like it's swirly under the sea. And then some of these are like the paw prints that my mum made. I mean, they're not fantastic. Some of these aren't brilliant because it's just a test one. But these Mickey Mouse ones, I think these Mickey Mouse ones are good. I like the blue one. So she made a green one. Uh, they haven't been sanded around yet, so they're still a bit sharp. There's a cat one. But I like the blue one. Just needs a bit more dye here on that side. Print, um, and then these, I like these ones because they're the colours that I've got on my wrist. Oh, I never even realised that. These are the colours that I've got on my wrist. Um, so we've got a cat one and the paw print one. And I like these because these ones, you could do these ones as a button. So if you've got something you want to put a button on, you can do these as buttons. But these ones here are very, very small. So this would be like a necklace or something to go on a, a bracelet. So we've got some glitter you can put in it. These again are the shapes, but they're de very tiny. And then these are the dye colours that you can put in. And obviously this is the, is that the resin? Yeah, the resin to put in. So yeah, we're gonna try, I'm gonna try them because I haven't tried them yet. What's that? That's the, the glitter. Oh. The mica, I think it's called. So yeah, that's what we're gonna do. But I'm gonna try a, mini ma a Mickey Mouse one. Because this is a cake mold. This isn't a, a thingy mold for resin. resin but they said that you can still use them and they've turned out really well because you can still see the pattern and stuff on them so they're still exactly the same so if you are trying resin get cake mold they're exactly the same um as long as the silicone so you can push them out it they don't matter right i've just done my resin you're not be able to see it as much now because it's in the dark but i've done a cat shape two paw prints a mickey mouse top up another mickey mouse some of the paw prints and stuff the ring a pyramid which we ran out of, um, we ran out of pyramids, we ran out of resin for, and then we also did, I also did some dog bones as well, but I'll show you tomorrow when they're dried. Right, I'm just gonna, like, cover my forehead, <laughs> um, but I've just had my hair dyed, if you can see, still got dye all over my hair, uh, so I'm gonna go and wash it off now, it is, like, 7 o'clock, so I'm gonna wash it off, but I wanted to show you something what I picked up from Aldi and show you a dupe of it. So this is the Liqueur Rock Candy Hearts Cleansing Hand Gel. Do not tell me that don't look like the Carex ones. I don't know whether they're going to be nice or what. Right, I'm going to flick this off. Oh, that smells like fruit salad. <laughs> oh yeah, that smells like fruit salad. So yeah, if you want to knock off of the Carex um, Love Hearts Hand Gel, go to Aldi. Hello everybody, so today is Saturday the 13th of February, it's 10 to 9. I'm going to go downstairs and get some breakfast now and finish getting myself ready. But anyway, yeah, I've just got myself ready because I'm going to take my mum to go and get a job today. Um, and then that's basically it. And then I'm going to come home and try the foundation and the mascara because I'm dying to try it. I'm dying to see whether that mascara is as good as everybody says. Um, and don't mind my spots as well. Since wearing my mask yesterday all these spots here started coming off but anyway so yeah i'm gonna go and take it to that and then i'll come back and i will show you my mascara hopefully i'm gonna do a tiktok on it like i said so please i'm praying it works but anyway i'm gonna go and i'll catch up in a bit bye right hello everybody it's now 10 to 12 i've been back for about an hour or so an hour and a half something like that um because we did manage to get in and out straight away so when you go in you have to go in one side and obviously and come out the other. So you go in, they tell you what to do. Um, they ask you a load of questions about, you know, if you've had the flu jab in the last seven days. They ask you all these different questions if you've got any allergies to medicines or anything like that. And then that's it really. And then they'll just say, what's your date of birth? You know, obviously they have to sh you have to show proof of your vulnerability or whatever you're going for. Um, and then they give you the jab and then that's it you get given a card a piece of paper with all the side effects and stuff what's it for and whatever it's whatever else um and then that's it that's basically it so you have a little card like that and you have one bit on it that will say your first vaccination your batch number the date it was done and then that'll be at the bottom there's another one which is obviously for the second dose that you have to have so yeah pretty simple pretty easy just went in and come straight back out so that is it so yeah i i'm now back i'm doing a i'm going to do a tiktok because i wanted to do the Superstay foundation and the last sensational 
mascara which i'm going to show you on this camera as well because i want to show you but i'm also going to make a tiktok because and you know if you don't bloody work i swear to god i'm going to scream i'm going to scream but yeah anyway let's go so i've just applied the foundation that i've had of the maybelline superstay like i said on my tiktok it's very dry looking around certain areas so i don't feel like they've changed it very much compared to what it was before so yeah i wish i could show you like actually let me just zoom you in a bit look how literally how cakey it looks all over and like there's a big patch here that's missing a foundation and all around my nose you can see it all coming off my nose yeah i'm sorry it's gonna have to come off it's gonna have to go so i've just done my makeup and i've changed it i've put my ex1 yeah, EX1 foundation on instead and put all the rest of my makeup on because I had to take it off because it just wasn't wasn't right at all. It looked awful. Absolutely horrible. So I've changed it on, put on my mascara. Make what the fuck is up with this? Oh my makeup up, but now I'm gonna try my mascara. So now I'm gonna do a TikTok on this properly. Oh Jesus. But yeah. Wish me luck because oh my god while well, balance on my brushes oh that's why it looks weird i'm just trying the maybelline mascara and um can we just have a minute i think i think we may have found my new mascara but wow look at that maybelline you you pulled through with the mascara you didn't do too well with the super the what's it called the foundation but the mascara i just want to cry because it's taken me so long to find mascara other than this one that actually does the same fucking thing oh my god i've been waiting for this one okay tiktok you've done you've done your job you've hyped it up and oh my god i forgot all of it oh shit right i'm gonna have to buy loads <laughs> i'm gonna have to buy loads I'm actually, I'm, just, I'm sitting in in shock because I've been trying for a very, very long time to find something that's exactly the same as this. I think I can to it. But this is the eye that normally goes normal. So we're going to try it on the fucked up eye. <laughs> yes. Yes. Right, let me tell you now. And I know this sounds so stupid, but I could cry at the fact that this mascara. I mean, just look. I could just cry because I I cannot tell you how long I've been looking for a mascara that does exactly the same as this one. My may Miss Baby wrong, and I found it. You don't understand. You literally don't understand how long I've been lusting and longing for a mascara that's like this. Oh Maybelline, Mwah! I just want to kiss y'all whoever come out with that idea because. Mwah! Thank you! <laughs> I have no words. TikTok, you did me good. Thank you very, very, very much. Right, well, I've now done all the makeup and stuff and done with TikTok, so I thought now nah, I'd jump on Animal Crossing because I was trying to do it on Among Us and yeah, the server's not working again today. So I'm just jumping on Animal Crossing. Um, I think Kyle's going to ring me probably later. I'm going to change all of this here. So I'm going to leave it how it is, but I'm going to just like make all the path the same because i saw on ryan ftw i think that's his name on youtube he's changed all his plaws a bit and i just think it looks really nice and i'm really dying to sort of like copy the same thing if you know what i mean but not copy him but like do something similar to what he's done because these flowers these are just dumped here because i didn't know where to put them and it's really annoying so i think i'm going to try and change it and do the sort of the same design but yeah that's what i'm gonna do just ordered dominoes we've got chocolate orange biscuits which i'm not gonna get out oh yeah there we go chocolate orange you can't even see it because it's a bit dark but chocolate orange cookies this is a valentine's special but it's for just for me <laughs> well i'm a mum then we've got a garlic bread pizza to share then I got my typical barbecue based pizza with, it's got chicken strips on it, pork bowl, pork meatballs, chicken and lots of cheese on it. So yeah, so I'm just about to go in the bath and I thought I'd 
use one of my Lush Bath Bombs for, for Christmas because I haven't used them yet. The question is, which one shall I use? I've got a, I've got some of my favourite ones basically, but I don't know which one to use. Oh my god, let me choose one. What's this one? This is a bubble bar, Snow Fairy Bubble Bar. Beautiful, but I'm not going to use that one. I want a bath bomb. Got Snow Fairy in there. What else have I got? Oh, Luxury, oh yeah. Let's use Luxury Lush Pod. Bum ba da bum ba da bum bum bum! Looks real lush, but let's use you in the bath tonight. So, hello everybody. Tonight, the time is now basically just gone. Five past eight, I've got out of the bath, as you can see. Yeah, don't mind my fringe, it does this when it's wet or, you know, heat gets to it. And I've just put on some fake tan because I've been watching back my vlogs um, from the summertime and most of that was actually quite natural, as in from holiday or sitting outside. I mean, not from last year, but the year before. And it was brown, like a little bit of colour to my skin. And I just thought, you know what, I'm going to do it. I'm going to just tan a little bit. I haven't done all my body, so if you actually took all my clothes off, you would see we have tanned. <laughs> um, because I can't be asked, And the fact that you're not going to see all my body anyway in the winter. So I've just done my arms, my chest here, my back of my neck, my face, and my, my shoulders and like the top of my shoulders, if you know what I mean. So just that bit here. <laughs> because in the winter... I don't get my legs out because it's freezing so there's no point and plus I'm not going to be going out with nothing on the bottom of my legs you know whereas in the summer obviously I would do but in the winter there's no point and I just thought I'm just going to do it I'm just going to make myself feel a bit better so I thought I'd put some on and just see because I love when I tried it last time the St. Mraz one and it just made my skin look so much more alive and even though I've got pale skin and I'm not really too bothered, you know, I, I can walk out without no tan on because I'm not bothered at all. And I don't normally fake tan at all. Sometimes I just, I try the gradual tan on, especially from Dove, and I just really like it and it just makes me look a bit more alive. And that's why I try it. So I thought I'd try it again to make myself feel better. So, so hello everybody. Today is the 14th of February, Valentine's Day. Welcome to the Valentine's Day. <laughs> I am um, currently just turned my computer on so I can edit this vlog. Uh, this is my tan. Try and show you in the light. You can see it on my hands very much, um, and then my arms as well. I don't think it's done a too bad of a job. It's just a bit dark on my hands. It looks worse on camera than it is actually on <laughs> in real life. Um, but this is my tan, and I think it looks quite nice. Like I say, this hand's not as bad, but my hands will be frequently washed, so they will probably come off in the end. I don't think it's done too bad so I might top it up with a bit of gradual tanner instead of actually tanning again so yeah, I'm gonna edit my vlog uh, to go up because I don't actually have a video idea to go up this week so I'm just gonna edit my vlog and yeah so and if you're wondering why I can't you know we haven't got any I haven't got a present or anything it's because I said to Kyle let's just not do Valentine's because we have basically said birthdays and we've just had um, Christmas as well, so there's no point. So yeah, anyway, I'm gonna edit my video now, edit my vlog, and then I'll catch up with you in a bit, probably when I get some dinner or whatever I'm doing, you know? So yeah, let go. So the last time I actually said anything on the camera was Sunday, so it was yesterday, and then I did my video and stuff, and then I didn't update you after that. So I basically went on Animal Crossing to try and find a villager. So yeah, I wanted to try and find a villager that I really wanted, however, didn't get anywhere with it, so just gonna leave it and see how what we get it was gonna take for ages it, it was gonna take forever because i already used like 50 odd tickets and i still won't really get anybody that i wanted so i think i'm just gonna let it go automatically but um yeah so then after that went downstairs i probably did some more resin had some dinner i didn't really do much yesterday i think that's why i didn't update you as much um but today's monday as you can see i'm obviously not at work um it's currently half past two in the afternoon i've just got myself dressed up a little bit because i felt like doing some tiktoks and i felt like going all out so that's why i look a little bit more presentable in this bit of the vlog <laughs> but my fringe is annoying me because it will not stay right 
and it's always this side that seems to go longer than the rest of it so but anyway i'm gonna just gonna end this vlog here because there's nothing else i'm gonna be doing and obviously i've got i go back to work tomorrow so yeah so i tan my skin but you're not even gonna be able to tell really on this camera but it is a little bit more like a brown color to my skin very natural looking um even though on this camera i look very white but yellow but anyway yeah so that's all i basically did i will show you maybe on instagram or something my little resin designs that i did um or i'll show you in the next vlog but yeah that is basically it so i hope you did enjoy this vlog if you did please give a big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe and i'll see you in the next one bye